Sam, can you hear me? I feel like it'd be crazy if we, like we're standing like shooting something like this and then we planted like four different people on different parts of the street reading the newspaper and then you just like pan to them, pan to them, pan to them. It'd be kind of nuts. We are in Le West Village and we got to get some photos for these bags that people uh, wanted. Long time coming. Long time. It took a year to produce. I was like adding up all the sample costs yesterday, all three different factories and everything. All in, I think it's like $8,000 in blown sample costs because couldn't use them because they were bad. But that's, that's the nature of the beast. Would you like a newspaper? Uh, all the way or am I good like that? Yep, that's good. This is Sean's favorite part of this. <laughs> what? When, no, when you have to be the guy standing here. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm leaving for work? Yeah. Is it natural? <laughs> that, was, that was natural. Now we're hitting on all cylinders. You gotta hurry. You got a tight window. Yep, uh-huh. I'm late for work. Oh, we missed it. I was too fast, too fast. <laughs> Get that on camera? God damn. That's awesome, man. Okay, so, Thank you yeah. so much. I bought you a hat back in 2020. It's been uh, following it since. So Hell yeah. What's your name? Here. Connor. Awesome, I appreciate yeah. it. Right I appreciate it. That's Looks awesome. like you got some good stuff there, too. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Right, Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. Yeah. yeah. What are the odds, dude? I guess the odds are increasing as like we release more stuff. That's what I always tell myself. I'm always like, bro, we should get another. 1,000 yeah. orders, <laughs> and we're bound to see some more in the wild, right? Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Why did you go so slow and limp? Okay, so we're each gonna have a newspaper, and we're gonna go four corners, reading the newspaper, post it up, and then you're gonna take that very 90s cinematic hard cut to all of us. <laughs> Man just ran me off the roof. <laughs> Wow. That's good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'm lucky. I'm lucky. Uh. Yeah, it's crazy. Half the events I get goosebumps until the finish because it's like you're just you're you're getting to watch like peak physical. Like this is the peak of human capability. That's insane.
Yeah, we're going to Albuquerque like from here tomorrow. We have USA. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. So we have like races, two races like Friday, Saturday, and then we all talk about it. So this bag has been in the works for two years since I first talked about it. I had made a couple minted minutes posts about where we were in the process and then mainly about the sampling process and having to switch manufacturers twice and all of that stuff. So when I finally found the manufacturer here in the city and we were going through with them, I made like the final post and I called it the bag saga and essentially laying out everything we went through to get it made. At the end of that post, I put like a link, like a sign up link where anybody that had been following along in the journey could sign up for early access. So I did this. We sent out this email with like each individual person gets a custom code and the custom codes didn't work. Like, so the products were locked behind a password box each person was supposed to get a custom code because we didn't want code sharing. Like it was supposed to be a one-time use code because I didn't want them to sell out before general release and have it like shared across everything. And it just didn't work. So we had to like go back to square one, how we normally do it, like locking the site and stuff, which opens us up to code sharing, which is risky because I don't want the bags to sell out before they even are open to the public. But we're just gonna have to cross-reference emails with the early access list and hope for the best. I'm just picking up zippers. Mabel, how are you? Just finished? That's good timing. Oh, good timing. Good timing. Perfect. How did you know we just finished? I called her 30 minutes ago and she said 30 minutes, you guys are good. <laughs> You're the best. Thank you so much. Have a good one. So these zippers are for jackets we're working on. Um, I have to get them over to my manufacturer in China because they're Riri zippers. And normally I would go through Riri directly, but there's like three, four week lead time out of Switzerland for the zippers. So I just had to buy them retail, but the jackets are rush order and uh, they need to be done by March 7th, and it's February 20th. Chinese New Year just ended, so factory's back open today, and it's gonna be tight to get them here, but once they arrive, I'll be able to talk about them more, I imagine. Another day, back on the grind. <laughs> but, but a little faster. <laughs> I knew there would be people that would end up buying it that hadn't been reading along the whole time or know, knew the whole process behind it. So I wrote a minted minutes and then just made it into newspaper form since the original inspiration for the bags were post bags that uh, newspaper carriers, mailmen would carry. I figured it kind of fits right into the theme. Hi, I'd like to schedule a pickup for Minted New York. And what time do you want the pickup? Can you do 6 p.m.? Perfect. You see my uh, pre-workout ad? New one? It was maybe my best cinematic masterpiece I've ever made. There are a lot of supplement companies out there. And a lot of those supplement companies sell pre-workout like this one right here. And while I think this pre-workout tastes amazing and is a great daily pre-workout, let me show you what else you can do with this pre-workout. You can create art. You can bowl. Football. Watch TV. But most importantly, 
help you achieve your fitness goals. <laughs> no, but because I already had that clip you edited, so I just stuck it in there. What is it? Maybe get one more on this side. You want it on the right side? Middle? All right. Eight, eight to 8 p.m. Weight time. Workouts 12 by 40 seconds uh, on the treadmill. Hill repeats 9% incline, 11 speed, 40 on, minute off. So it's a double day. So we had a workout this morning on the track. Three sets of two miles at like 5:48 per mile. And now we have this. Six. And the day's done. Got to eat dinner. Before I came here, I threw my chicken in the air fryer and I have my rice ready in the pan. So the stove's not on. I didn't leave the stove on. It's just ready to heat. 